Welcome back to the Crown of the Ivory King. Alright, there's a couple things to do. I do need to fight the boss, the gigantic, beautiful tiger monster thing. But before that, let's do a couple other things. The first thing is to remove my Ring of the Embedded, which I was kind of excited about, uh, using it, that is, because it promised surprises. Gain surprises, but take increased damage. Well, as some people in the comments told me, apparently the surprises kind of blow. The surprises are apparently just stat increases, I think. So that's not very good. Yeah, screw that thing. That thing is very, very disappointing. So let's go back to the second dragon ring. That thing is wonderful. The other thing I was going to do... Oh yes, well it's not something I'm actually going to like change, but uh, somebody also told me that um, apparently you have to backstab using the right hand weapon. So I kept trying to do this attack. The power stance dual attack when attacking people from the back, and I was wondering why that wasn't backstabbing. I was thinking maybe these weapons can't backstab or something like that, but I believe they can. It just seems that you have to use the right hand weapon. So if I'm behind somebody, then I should probably just do this. And we'll see if that works. Okay, the other thing to do before I go fight the boss, I believe the last thing I want to do is go check that uh, locked place behind all the zombies and the one dude with the stuff. The place that has the locked door. Since I do now have a key, although again, the key is the eyeball, which isn't really much of a key. But it is technically a key, so I kind of want to go check that. I'm trying to remember how to get there. I should go to the bonfire first, right? Shit, I can't remember. Uh. Okay, well, I'm 99% sure that this is going to be completely fruitless. So I'm going to go find it. And when I do, I'll be right back. Okay, let's try this guy and test my key. I should probably just lead him around the corner. Come on. Oh, shit. No, I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna be fine. It won't kill me. And then I just need one good hit. Oh shit! No! Ugh. Wonderfully timed dodges. Backstab! Ugh. Yeah! Get down! Get down with it. So yeah, I've been using the, uh, practicing the backstabs, and yeah, they're actually really easy to get. Just gotta use the right weapon instead of the left one. Literally and figuratively, the right weapon. Now the real fight begins. Help me. Alright, so I don't think my eyeball is gonna fit into this lock. Surprise! It did not. Yeah, I really didn't expect it to. But technically it is a, it is a key, so. Wanted to try it. Okay, one other thing I want to mention before I get to the boss, and that's that somebody said that these weapons that I'm using, the the Falchions, Falcons, however you pronounce it, somebody said that they do actually have a sweet spot for damage. And I was thinking they don't. I, I kind of just assumed that any bladed weapon that has a blade over the entire surface of the weapon would not have a sweet spot. Because, you know, any point of it is sharp. I figured the only things that have sweet spots would be things like halberds, which obviously have the blade at the tip and then the rest is just a pull. And, I don't I guess maybe hammers would have a sweet spot, I don't actually know, I've never used them. But, somebody said that these do have a sweet spot. And, I'm curious, can anybody confirm or deny this? 
Does anyone know? Because I searched online, and I couldn't find any reference to it, and I've been testing it a little bit, and I can't, like, it doesn't seem to actually have a sweet spot. Here, let me show you. So let me try close attacks and far attacks. So here's a, I'm going to just use single attacks with my right weapon. Alright, so here's as close as possible. Alright, 203. Now let's try far away, at the tip. 179. Alright, up close, 203. 184. 150. I, I believe the reason it varied so much and why it was sometimes lower when I was far away is because of probably... Um, I don't remember what it's called. The thing where your weapon does more damage if you attack them when they're attacking. But regardless of the variance, like, as far as I can tell, it doesn't make a difference where you attack them. So can anybody confirm or deny whether these weapons actually do have a sweet spot? Whether they do more damage if you hit them at the tip? Versus up close? Okay. Well, let's go fight the boss, shall we? Put my new backstabbing skills to work and try to backstab a gigantic snow tiger. And, uh, yeah, you can't actually backstab bosses, right? I'm pretty sure you can't. They just seem too... big. <clears throat> I mean, how would you backstab a big tiger? Like, stab in the tail? I mean, the only other thing I can do other than fighting this boss, as far as I can tell, is to attempt to make that jump again. That crazy big jump. But I'm pretty sure you're not required to do, required to do that to progress. I think it's just an, an extra thing. Okay. This will be my first time actually seriously trying to fight this boss, not as a box. Maybe if I don't move, it won't see me. Sweet. I've won the encounter. Okay, I want to leave now. Excuse me. I want to leave. Let me out. I don't like it in here. It's cold. My face is starting to turn green. See? This place is bad for my skin. Can I destroy these things? Nah, I know it can destroy them, though. I know it can destroy them by plowing through them like a, a drunkard plows through a... Uh, never mind. Hi. Hi. Alright, let me try to get in his feet. It's usually the best thing for large creatures! Oh shit. I'm doing so much damage. All right, you trying to pounce, huh? Oh shit! All right. Oh no! All right, let me try running to the side. I'm gonna try running to the side. Uh, okay, it worked. Ooh, I'm under you. Oh god, you have defenses against that. Okay. Didn't time it right. What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? Okay, so he's got two AoEs. Gotcha. <laughs> he lost his targeting and it looks like he forgot about me for a second. He's like, where did he go? This actually isn't so bad so far. Okay. Run. 
run to the side right about now. Ooh, okay. Only hit him with one sword. Yeah, this really isn't so bad so far. I'm trying strong attacks. I don't know if that's a good idea. He really likes to pounce. All right, playful little, playful little kitty. Whoa! What is that? Okay, it's fine. No probs. No probs. Shit, okay, bad, bad, bad. Shit, shit, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. One hit is one pot. What are you doing? Okay, good, good, good. Stay still. early. Okay, this is good. Gives me time to heal. Excellent. I'm running out of pots, though. Oh, shit. That healing was pointless. I took the damage right back a second later. Keep doing that too early. He destroyed those beautiful statues. Ow. Oh man, I'm so close. Damn it. I've done that too early like 50 fucking times. Fuck off. Well, I think I've got his attack patterns pretty well down. This boss really isn't too hard. Um, I'm not sure if I should be using the strong attacks with my weapons, or if I should be using multiple small attacks. Let's go ahead and use one of these. Get my health back up. Yeah, I remember reading in some wiki that, in some wiki that these weapons are apparently unreliable against bosses, whatever that means. So if I find a boss too hard, I could always switch back to my halberd, just for that boss. But I don't feel like I need to for this one. This one does not seem too bad. My souls. Did I actually have any souls? I don't know if I did. Wakey, wakey. My spectral frozen friend. Oh, you're gonna start off with that? Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, I like strong attacks. Over small ones. Small ones occupy me for too long. 
going to die in like two seconds. Hold on, I got this. I forgot that I did not switch my Estus. I tried to switch my Estus, Estus my shitty, faulty D-pad, switch my weapon. I tried to switch my weapon back, and then I died. And that's the story of my life. My shitty, defective Xbox 360 controller. <laughs> it's really annoying, too, because if you switch your weapon out, it undoes your power stance, which means once you switch it back to your weapon, you have to press the power stance button again. So it's like a multi-staged thing. Alright, fuck my souls. Actually, never mind, they're right there. Walk slowly, you won't know I'm here. Or she. I don't know if it's he or she. I still am doing that too early. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no! Saw that coming. Back step! Haha. I cut your back legs. Got you in the ass. Oh shit! It was too late. Damn. It's weird, I feel like my timing got worse from the first time I tried to kill him. Usually you're supposed to get better the more you try things, right? Yeah, I can't help but feel that the halberd would be a lot better at this. In fact, honestly, I feel like big weapons might be better for bosses just in general, because typically how bosses go is that... Typically what makes them so hard is that, not only do they have a lot of health, but also that your window of opportunity for attacking them is extremely low. And when that's the case, when you do attack, you want to do a lot of damage, because you usually don't have much time to attack. So, I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about fast weapons with bosses. I'm gonna try using fast attacks. We'll see what happens. That is not the right way. Yeah, no, fuck fast attacks. 
They occupy my time too much. Shit. Oh, man. Fuck me. I've never wanted to murder such a beautiful creature so much before in my life. I'm gonna kill you, you fucking beautiful snow tiger. Yeah, fast attacks are just not good. That occupies my time way too much. You know, I start queuing up a second attack, and then it starts swiping, and then I can't dodge, and then I'm fucked. Nope. So one attack or nothing. I mean, the time it takes for one strong attack is pretty similar to the time it takes for one quick. In terms of how long... In terms of how long it occupies my time before I can dodge, like, quick attack, dodge, 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 dodge. That's how quick. And then strong attack. It's pretty much the same. It might be exactly the same, actually. That was an imp impotent swipe. Oh, shit! I was running forwards too much, I guess. <laughs> I think we were both confused, like, I'm stuck in your shoulder, that's weird. Good time to heal. Oh shit. Oh fuck, I think I got stuck on something. on that timing. Whew. Yeah, damn it. Where am I? Oh god. Stuck in your furry folds? Oh, again?
Again? Oh my god. God, he ran away. Give me time to heal. Oh. Okay, good. Gives me time to heal. How did that miss? Bastard's getting dodgy. Oh shit! Mistimed it. Get away, get away, get away! Okay, good. Perfect. Perfect. I wonder what happened if I tried to attack him while he was doing that thing. Probably be a terrible idea. Shit, 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 get away, get away. Oh, oh, what's gonna happen? Oh no! Oh, it's fine. <laughs> it looked worse than it was. I got him. I got him. One good hit. That's not a good hit. One good hit. Yes! Ooh. Soul of... How do, how do they pronounce it? Almost sounded like Alva. Av Ava? Ava? Not Ava. Well, regardless. I got it, Soul. Ah, I just want to pat myself on the back and recognize what I've just accomplished. I have just come, as an undead person, into an area where I'm not supposed to be and I'm unwelcome, and I just killed a beautiful creature that was attempting to guard this place. So truly, I am the hero of the lands, killing this innocent creature that is trying to defend its, its master or whatever. This beautiful, beautiful creature. And I murdered it. I'm such a hero. I wonder what I can make with that soul. In terms of weapons and armor and stuff. Secrets? Does not open from this side. Hmm? Huh? How how do you get to the other side? I don't see no pathway leading back there. Huh. Alright. Yeah, <laughs> if it doesn't open from this side, then how do you get to the other side? Oh, you can probably go from up above, right? Eh, maybe. Let's, let's get a nice, dramatic, slow walk up here. Wind and a blizzard blowing in my face. 
I've come to reclaim my throne. Hope you kept it warm. Better not be any gold bars or gems or decapitated chickens near the throne. I've heard some people are weird like that. Master ahead, therefore, praise the sun. Ah. Bonnie. Try arm and then joy. Huh? What the hell does that mean? Try arm. <laughs> what? Enemy ahead, and then enemy ahead. I think that sums up the entire game, doesn't it? Try arm. Like, the arm of the statue? Well, I don't know. Another frozen thing. Oh my. Oh my. Well, this seems like a suitable place to have a sort of cliffhanger ending. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.